Welcome everybody to Clarington Kia. Today we're going to take you on a tour of this 2014 BMW 328 xDrive with just over 128,000 kilometers on it. Beautiful black on black BMW in fantastic condition. Now we're going to take you on a tour to show you the exterior and interior, dings, dents, scratches, anything we can find as far as condition goes and we'll review a couple of the great features as we do our tour. So starting off right here uh, with the fact we're at the front quarter shot, that beautiful shot of this vehicle. And of course, as you know, BMW, legendary as far as um, compromising, you know, sport for luxury. The all wheel drive system on this BMW is fantastic as well. And the condition of this particular one is incredible. This is a 2014, like I said, 128,000 kilometers. And the Carfax shows no accident in history, which is great news. And I want to point out one thing here. The only flaw, if you want to call it, is the fact that this does not come with the original BMW wheels. All we have here are the RTX um, alloy wheels on winter tires. So the bonus to that, the bonus to that is means you get to buy some really cool alloy wheels for your summertime and put on whatever summer rubber you'd like and keep this thing looking as sporty or as classy as you wish, depending on what choice of wheels you go with. Now, looking down this driver's side here, there are a couple very, very, very minor door dings right in this area, but they're super, super, super shallow. It's very hard to see them. You probably can't even catch it on this video. You have to take a really big step back to kind of catch them. Super tiny though, nothing to be concerned about. I haven't broken the paint at all. Now coming around to the back here, you can see these nice big tail lights here. And then we have this beautiful spoiler that's been added on to the back of the trunk lid here. Nice little lip spoiler and a carbon fiber look. We have the X-Drive logo there. Of course, the BMW Vag 328. And the rear bumper is in very nice condition. Does not look like a German Shepherd bit it. And I always say that because when people put things in and out of the trunk, sometimes they drag it in and that back bumper can look pretty gnarly. You'll also notice back here, we do have the rear parking sensors, which I'll kind of give you an idea of how that looks when we get in the car. Now coming around the passenger side, Again, looks to be in great shape. I'm not seeing any major dings, scratches, dents, anything really to report here. Oh wait, let's look here. So this might, might be a little scratch. Maybe polish that up, but just a little thing right here on the side view mirror, not a big deal. Uh, coming around to the front now, we get a look at these beautiful headlights here on the BMW. Have that nice LED halo look to them as well and then we have fog lights down below we do have the additional black kidney beam or kidney shaped uh, grills for this we have the chrome ones as well uh, they're in a box that are available for this vehicle when you pick it up so if you wanted to change those back to the chrome ones you could do that too the front here looks fantastic i'm not seeing any dings dead scratches the hood looks incredible as well now let's go take a look on the inside we'll start with the rear seats Taking a look back here. Whoops, I left the mat from the floor here. Taking a look back here. These seats are in great shape. No rips, tears, stains, or burns. Taking a whiff, definitely a non-smoker vehicle as well. You even have the BMW rubber floor mats down here. Looking at the driver and passenger here. We have that power tilt and slide sunroof up top. These seats, again, in great condition. You'll notice the driver's seat here has a power driver's seat with a two driver memory setting. Passenger seat as well, very good condition. Uh, something you'll commonly see on these is sometimes the bolster here starts to really crack and tear. This is in great shape. Again, nice mats down below. You can see the BMW luxury door sill plate here too. Let's hop in. Oh, it's cold out today. So we've got 128,000, let me zoom in here, 128,836 kilometers on this BMW. Very low for 2014. Cruise control on the wheel, radio controls on the wheel. We've got your automatic wipers, automatic headlights over here, all the stuff you'd normally expect. Something you might not expect though, is in the infotainment system, we do have the navigation system. So this does come with the navigation as well as the connected services. So I'll show you that here. So you can see 
we do have the connected drive which is a uh, basically a subscription service to give you some information for real-time traffic uh, weather etc um, <clears throat> the office uh, which I'll be honest with you I don't think many people use that anymore uh, but we do have the big one is the navigation system here now the way I'm accessing all that you might be wondering is not by black magic but by this command controller down here so you can see all the buttons and then this acts like a mouse you can go left right you can also toggle it up and down and then push down for enter you can even use it as a scroll pad to like write numbers and things like that that will all work there too which is really kind of cool so uh the command controller for bmw was and still is actually quite a uh, convenient and nice tech feature to have in any vehicle let alone back in 2014 as you can appreciate now uh, looking up front here, we've got a CD player uh, for you younger kids. That was a little disc you slide in there and it had music on it, about 18 to 24 tracks. Um, yeah, don't laugh. Oh, 90s babies. Anyway, <laughs> dual zone climate control, uh, three stage heated seats for the driver and passenger up front. Uh, I should have noted too that it is a heated steering wheel. You can find that button right here. Uh, so the heated steering wheel gets nice and warm, obviously in the winter time too. That combined with the climate control and the heated seats, this thing is great for winter driving considering it's all wheel drive. We've got the beautiful red start stop for your push button start because it does have the proximity key. Uh, and then look at this, this is a nice little touch here. This is an added accessory, but this pops out to reveal your cup holders. But I love this cover uh, that you can just kind of attach in there and it looks pretty sweet. Um, we have the very iconic BMW shifter. Uh, so really simple, foot on the brake push here for reverse which then pulls up our nice rear view camera and as you can see here this is the portion here that would give you uh, the sensor reading for their forward and reverse uh, sonar it'll pop up there as you get closer to things so that way you uh, don't park a little bit too close even on the front which is great for parking in parking lots or your condo or wherever it is you want to get nice and tight to that wall but not hit it that's what the sonar is for um, and then of course to go into drive push down for drive you can even go over and shift it manually if you wanted that way uh, and then to put it into park just tap on the p and we're back in park uh, we do have a couple different drive modes we have sport and eco pro uh, those will go through the different driving modes for the 328 to kind of tune the engine and uh, how the vehicle performs which is you know something nice to have in a bmw for sure it's not as relevant with a kia but a bmw will definitely you can put it through the paces uh, and then you can turn off those rear and front parking sensors if you wish if you find that they're annoying or whatever the case is and then in the armrest here we've got our snap in bmw uh phone adapter which i'll be honest is probably irrelevant nowadays but we do have a usb port down in there and an auxiliary port as well uh bluetooth audio streaming yes and it also has a uh, Sirius uh, XM satellite radio too. So if you want to listen to all your digital music, you can still do that. That's no problem. Give me a nice little tour here of the front dash. But again, a 2014 BMW with 128,000 kilometers on it. Um, you know, if you're going to knock it for only one thing, it would be for the wheels that don't come with the factory BMW wheels. But I promise you, you can find a fantastic set of wheels that will suit your style, your taste, to match this fantastic black on black BMW right here at Clarington Kia. So if you want to purchase this vehicle, www.clarentonkia.ca or visit us in person right here in Bowmanville. We serve all of Ontario, GTA, Niagara, Kingston, Ottawa, doesn't matter. You can find this car online, you can buy it online and then we can bring it to you directly if you like or you can visit us here in showroom and uh, experience our amazing sales team here. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and I can't wait to see who gets behind this beautiful BMW.